Hello, and welcome to, In the No Philippines, and my name is Odessa. And if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. The Symbolite Combat Vehicle was designed by GKN primarily for export market sales. And following continuous and rigid trials, was selected by the Armed Forces of the Philippines, which placed an initial order of 150 vehicles. Of the 150 vehicles ordered, 8 were delivered in complete kit form, 2 in lockdown kit form, and the remainder were later assembled in the Philippines in a facility owned by the joint venture company, Asian Armored Technologies Corporation in Subic Bay. The Simba Armored Personnel Carrier was designed as a family of vehicles. Included in the initial offerings were a basic configuration, one-man turrets with either machine guns or 20mm cannon, a two-man turret with a Cockerell MK390 mm gun, an open anti-aircraft mounting with a relic on HS820 20mm cannon, and a variant fitted with the Emerson Talantra originally developed for the M901 ITV. It was offered with one of two levels of armor, the basic kit, resistant to bullets up to 7.62 mm ball ammunition and shrapnel, with the heavier suite capable of defeating 7.62 mm armored piercing rounds as well. The only country to purchase the Simba was the Philippines, who bought around 150 vehicles during the 1990s, to be assembled in kits locally at a facility at Subic Bay. Malaysia looked into acquiring the type, but selected the Belgian Sibmas family instead. The primary user of the vehicle within the Philippine Armed Forces is the Philippine Army, with a smaller number going to the Presidential Security Group. Two variants were fielded, one with a one-man turret with a .50 caliber square meters machine gun, and the second with a one-man turret with a 25mm or Lequan cannon of the type used on the country's FMC. Either variant could be fitted with a pintle-mounted 40mm automatic grenade launcher, made by Chartered Arms Singapore, later Saint Kinetics, on top of the turret. Both variants feature smoke grenade dischargers mounted on the turret. Have you seen a Simba in person or perhaps in action? Comment down below. And if you liked this video, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe and tap or click on the notifications icon so you won't miss any updates. We will continue to give you more updates about the Philippine military. Once again, my name is Odessa. Thank you and thanks for watching.